Hello, Mercy from Print-A-Pot here. Um, today we are going to look at our plants as well as give you a behind the scenes look at Print-A-Pot. Um, earlier today I made a little short video uh, on these magnetic pineapple air plant holders that we're going to be releasing in a few days. Um, right now this is just a prototype. Um, it's our pineapple pot but with a flat back and a magnet that we attach and you can attach this to your fridge. Sean, our printer slash 3D designer, added a little sort of like a little pouch for the magnet inside the pineapple holder um, and he's gonna try to drop the magnet in during printing and see if that will work instead of having me glue the magnets on the back like this so this was our first prototype um, it looks nice and shiny uh, but there are some holes in the back just because of how the 3D printer um, like how the how the program sliced the design anyway we do have several plants here at our home um, these are some of our little hedgehog pots super cute I am propagating some succulents. I think this one has some roots already. Come over here. Yeah, see his little roots? Yeah. I might just stick them into some dirt right now, like this. Well, I should probably do it more gently, so I'll do that later. Um, we recently got, or I recently bought, um, some of these hens and chicks from Hertz Gardens um, through Etsy. They're in Ohio and it was super fast shipping. Um, this is a bromeliad that Sean got from Home Depot. Um, some potted house plant that was dying and we're trying to revive it. Here's an amaryllis in the Bulbasaur pot. Um, Venus flytrap from Hertz as well. Some more succulents, a cactus, some of our air plants. Some of them I'm trying to revive from shipping. We got them a while we had a huge snowstorm, so I don't think some of them made it all the way. And this is, um, one of Sean's experimental two color hedgehogs. I wanted to call him Wolverine, but then we decided to call him Sir Hedgehog because his silver spikes make him look like he's wearing armor. So we will be releasing these magnetic pineapple pots uh, later this week. And here are some of our plants. This guy. Napa cabbage that I'm starting from seed. I should probably mist some of my plants with our Prince of Pot Mister. What is this succulent doing over here? So when you take care of air plants, you want to mist them in the mornings so that they have time to dry and I also read that um, they need to breathe at night 
and so they can't breathe if you have if you have them watered so it's best to mist them in the mornings let their leaves soak in the nutrients and let them dry and then at night they will breathe Thank you for watching our behind the scenes video. Visit our store at printapot.com or follow us on Facebook and Instagram 